Imagine this, June 30, 1908, in the remote Siberian wilderness near the Tunguska River. The morning calm is shattered by an unimaginable blast. A colossal fireball, brighter than the sun, tears across the sky. Seconds later, a shockwave explodes with the force of a thousand Hiroshima bombs. It's flattening over 2,000 square kilometers of forest and area larger than modern-day London. 80 million trees are snapped like twigs, all pointing away from a central point. Local Enki herders and Russian settlers are thrown to the ground. Windows in a town 65 kilometers away are blown out. The sound is deafening, the heat intense. People hundreds of kilometers away see the flash and feel the tremor. In fact, seismic stations all around the world register the event. But when the first scientific expeditions finally reached this isolated region years later, they found something baffling. There were flattened trees, scorched earth, but no impact crater, not a single large fragment of whatever caused this devastation. So, what happened? The leading theory, backed by overwhelming evidence, is an atmospheric explosion. Stony asteroid, or possibly a small comet, estimated to be about 50 to 60 meters wide, entered Earth's atmosphere at incredible speed. It never reached the ground. Instead, the immense pressure and heat caused it to catastrophically explode about 5 to 10 kilometers up in the air. This airburst vaporized the space rock instantly, unleashing all its energy at once. This explains the immense destruction without an impact crater. Eyewitnesses described the sky splitting in two and for several nights afterward. The skies over Europe and Asia glowed with an eerie light. A midnight sun caused by dust particles scattered high in the atmosphere, Computer simulations of asteroid entries perfectly match the destruction pattern seen at Tunguska. Analysis of microscopic particles found in tree resin from the area reveals minerals consistent with meteorites. Thanks to the region's extreme remoteness, the human cost was minimal, with perhaps only two fatalities reported. But the event serves as a chilling reminder. It wasn't a world-ending catastrophe, but it shows us the very real and destructive power that space objects hold. Tunguska isn't just a mystery solved. It's a warning from the cosmos. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this journey into one of history's biggest cosmic mysteries, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell so you don't miss our next video. See you next time.